Hello there, everyone. Welcome to Affinity League 11. We're starting off with the first match. Playing first, which is grand. Um, This hand is interesting. The opal can feed into the ravager a little bit. Uh, we have a blast for an answer come turn two. Not any sooner. Uh, I guess it sort of has the game plan of going all in on Ravager, which doesn't seem that great, but we have the Blink Moths for backup. I don't think it's... I think it can only get worse, so I'm going to keep. This... It seems iffy to me. Especially having... I mean, I guess I can answer their turn one thing with a blast by activating Nexus, but I can't do any more than that. Legion Moyalist. Is that worth blasting right away? I don't think so. It only gets Battalion when it and two others attack. So, I'm going to hold back. And that is creatures you control gain first strike and trample and can't be blocked by creature tokens. Well, good for me. I don't have creature tokens. Um, I suppose I'll eat the opal right away. I'm not really doing anything with it. And... I'll save the blast for something bigger. It's fine. Probably could have held on to the opal if I was foreseeing use of extra mana, which I guess would be my next turn. It would have been useful. But I also have a viable blocker with the Ravager now. So that's of use. Uh, and I think I'm just going to chip in for one. Maybe two. I think two is fine. don't really need a blocker. Do I want to get in with Memnite as well? I mean, I kind of doubt that they're going to block with that, so we'll go. We'll go all out. Whatever they come at me with, I can I can blast probably. Um I haven't really seen a deck that uses Legion Loyalist except maybe 8 whack. would be my guess. Yeah, that's a free attack on their part. Um, I'm not going to block it. I have nothing to block it with. I don't think... It gets plus 2, plus 0 oh for each other attacking goblin. That seems like it'd get pretty big. Um, yeah, I'll take care of it now. That seems fine. It avoids getting too scary with that sort of thing. Um, kind of tempted to get in with Ink Moth to spread my... But that's spreading my damage. It'd be 4 damage or 3 damage and 1 poison. I think the 4 seems a little better. I'm probably leaving myself a bit open to some sort of alpha attack. I also probably should have eaten the drum there to get the extra damage. Yeah. Okay, so this is... 8 whack. 
Oh yeah. Double hits. Pretty big. Three six eight. Decent amount. And with that, they're winning the race. <coughs> if we could have drawn a plating, that would have been quite good. Um, oh, hold on. One, two with a pump. So activate. Two with a pump. Three with another pump. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Can I get 10? Oh, I should have attacked last turn. I could have gone... Yeah, I don't think I can... One. By activating here. Two. By activating here. Three. By activating here. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, yep. Should have done that last turn. Um, do I die next turn? Potentially. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I can't win this turn either way. I have more avenues of attack if I do it in damage. Probably have to leave up an activation here or some blocks or something. Because I can block with, say, Mem Knight. And then eat something with Ravager. I'm going to spread my damage out so that I can potentially win. Either way, next turn. I think if I have... I think I have enough defending. I could be wrong. It has three cards in hand. But I have one blocker. Probably coulda, shoulda left up Ravager. If they don't have lethal, I don't have to block. Ooh. Chieftain. Well, that's fun and exciting. First strike and trample. Two, four, seven, nine. Oh, not dead. So they all have trample, which means blocking is irrelevant. Two, four, six, nine. I died to a bolt, but uh, there's nothing I can do about that at this point. Should have attacked with the Ink Moth Nexus last turn. Because then I could have had him. And here's a bolt. Oh, Goblin Grenade. Even better. Alright, well, I deserve that. <sighs> Made a bad choice. Uh, eight whack. I don't think I've played against eight whack. Um, Blood Moon's bad. Grid's bad. Champ is probably good. Master, I can go down one. Uh, Scourge for Life Gain's probably good. Mem Knight's probably bad. Jar's good. Might not need the dispatch. Probably just the whip flares and getting an extra champ. Sounds fine. Ugh, could have had the last one if I had attacked differently. Tut tut, tut tut. Alright. This one is slow but has a high top end sort of thing. Large damage. It's probably not, it's not very fast though. Is it too slow? Potentially. I'm going to mulligan. I think it's too slow. This got even worse. 
which is great. Alright, forced to keep that. Uh, and yeah, top it. Fun stuff. Fun stuff. Should have just kept my first hand. Got a little greedy, I guess. And I guess I probably should have uh, bottomed this because it's not overly useful here. Volscourge should help us a little bit as long as it stays alive. And by a little bit, I mean probably a lot of it. Because as long as it survives next turn with a swing, it'll be one, two, three, four, five lifelink, which will be good. Ah, but that can deal one damage to target creature or player, which will totally put us in Deadland. Great start, great start. There's male field dies. Create a 1-1 one, one goblin creature token. So unless we get a way to buff Volt Scourge's toughness and soon. Oh goody. Oh goody. Sarcasm. A little bit of sarcasm. If I can get in this hit, eh. they're gonna debate. Yep, 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 yep. And now we just might be cooked. Monk fanatic, no bueno. I guess we're on plan uh, poison them before they kill us. Whip Flare would be really good to draw. But that's a 2 in 53 chance. Yeah, not happening. Cool. Uh, I'm going to play this one to get in for an extra damage. If we don't die next turn, and they don't have a way to kill Ink Moth Nexus, uh, we win. So there's that. Goblin guides. Decent for them. They're leaving one mana open. Which does not bode well. Ink Moth Nexus. That is not sufficient. Because it doesn't buff them past. Bolt. Um, but we have not much option but to go all in, I think. Is this where they kill it? No. Okay, well, I'm going to attack solely with Ink Moth because I don't think there's much reason to 
do it any other way. If they have the thing to kill my dude, then, uh, yep. Shocker. Then they have the thing to kill my dude. Hmm. I get an extra blocker if I activate Blink Moth. Or Signal Pest becomes bigger. Hmm. I guess I'm only killing one thing either way, so it's probably better to equip this. Yeah, we're pretty dead now. Awesome. Another land. One, two, three, four, five. I'll block. Because I still have Blink Moth. Really, my only, my biggest, and perhaps only. Ooh, well, I would have been dead if I. Still dead. Awesome. Super cool. Well, that was a great first round. Uh, thanks for watching. We'll hopefully not get so aggroed out in the next one.